Hello, I'm Richard Teta Foley from Group 2 and today I'll be talking and communicating with patients who are going through the, uh, the stages of grief. So there are five stages of grief. We have first being denial, second being anger, third being bargaining, depression, then acceptance. So we are going to be demonstrating these stages of grief for our patient who has lung cancer. So, Good morning. Hello. How are you feeling? I'm okay actually. The medicine is there. It's help. Like, I don't feel anything at all. I'm ready to go home. Okay. Interesting. Can I sit with you? Yeah, sure. So, the results from the test yesterday came through. And I want to talk to you about them. Yes. What is it? Um, from the results yesterday, we found found something found something in your chest you came yesterday with chest pains so i ran a couple of tests on you and yesterday we found the mass what does that mean so what i don't understand what does it mean it means i'm so sorry to tell you but it means you have cancer you're telling me i have cancer I know it's difficult to hear. Uh, no. This is a joke, right? You know, it's not a joke. I can assure you that this is very real and the tests are very true. You. No. How can I have cancer? I'm, I'm young. Don't old people get cancer? No. No. Young people can also get cancer. And this is what the results show. The result can't be true then just run them again or something run them um are you sure you did them right yes the results were run multiple times i won't be here if the results were not conclusive <sighs> i know it's difficult to understand this but please i need you to accept this so so what can we do now uh, i can pay it's it's fine just what do we need to do surgery chemo what what is it radiation like uh, mine is not a problem. I just want to get better. Just get me better. Just at this stage of your condition, um, I'm sorry to say, but uh, there are no treatments available for your condition. What? So there's nothing we can do. We all we can do is keep you comfortable for now. I. Oh, just. There's, what's the point anymore? There's there's no point of doing any of this. It's there's nothing. Just I understand this is a very difficult moment for you, but you have to know that we are here for you and we'll support you with anything you need. If there's anyone you want to talk to, um, you're all here to I support guess you. I guess if if this is this is the way it's going to end, I would like to spend as much time with my loved ones as, as I can. It's, it's good to talk to your lover. It's great hearing you accept this grief and be able to move on. I will see what I can do for you and your family. Thank you. Yeah.